everybody, it's Doll Trick, and on today's episode of Push Play, which is a part of my daily series, A Trick A Day, we're going to take a look at volume mixing in live, but from Push's interface. So let's get started. Over here, I have got some kind of drum clip pulled up with a couple of other elements inside it. So let's go ahead and take a listen to what this sounds like. Cool. Turn off the metronome too. So I got a rough idea of how things sound, but what if I wanted to maybe make this a little bit softer or louder? Instead of being in device mode over here on the top right of push, I can press on the mix button and that's gonna put me in mix view instead of device view, which was the previous view that we were in. Now I can see that if I play this clip back, I'm gonna end up seeing some levels and you can actually see my voice coming in too. So here we go. We've got levels showing up in the LED screen. And I can use the knob above it to make the track softer or louder. Let's keep it there for now. Great. Something else that I can do is even mix the levels of the sounds within the drum rack that I have over here. I can do that by pressing again on the name of the drum rack and that's gonna give me access to the other racks inside of it or the other kinds of sounds on each pad. So over here, if I play this clip again, and if I scroll a little bit to the right, we'll be able to see some of the other sounds show up as individual levels. Got a kick over here, clap is over there, closed hi-hat is over there. Let's adjust some of these levels, maybe make the clap softer, but the kick louder. Bring down the hi-hats too. And once I'm done with that, I can close the rack up again by pressing on its name. And now we're back to what we were originally seeing. And that's how you would do some volume mixing on push for things in live using the mix view. And that's the trick for today. So if you enjoyed this trick, please like, comment, share, subscribe. You can also turn on the notification bell so that you can be notified of whenever I have a new video out to share more tricks with all of you. So thanks for watching as always, and I hope to see you at the next video. Bye. Doll trick.